I love to experience the flavors of other cultures. So today I've invited some friends over to take our taste buds on a world tour. Dig in, guys. Maxine, I'll give you some rice. Oh, nice. Oh, that's great. First stop, the Caribbean. Trinidadian chicken stew. Hearty comfort food with bold island flavor. Citrus rice salad. An infusion of worldly flavor in every mouthwatering bite. Mango and lime lassi, straight from India, this drink tastes as happy as it looks. It's an around the world adventure right in my own backyard. Todd and I have a friend named Cheryl that's from Trinidad. And when she first made this dish for me, I was kind of skeptical because of all that dark brown sugar, but I'm telling you, it is amazing. And it's something that I crave all the time. So I figured today, I was gonna bring those flavors back into my kitchen. So I've peeled the carrots and potatoes. We're gonna use them in a minute. But first, I heated up my stock pot with a little bit of vegetable oil. And I wanna start by adding some brown sugar. We're gonna add two tablespoons of dark brown sugar. Now remember, the darker the sugar, the more molasses is in it. And that's what creates that smokiness. So what I wanna do is caramelize the brown sugar. And then we're gonna sear the chicken in the caramelized brown sugar. It's gonna be out of this world, I promise. So we'll just break it up. And I remember when Cheryl first made it for us, I kinda of watched it and it would slowly start to heat up and slowly start to caramelize, and I thought, okay, well, then it's done. And she said, no, 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 you gotta let it boil so you can really smell that intense molasses flavor and sweetness kind of permeates the kitchen. 